Telangana has recently launched an online land record portal, Dharani. How can this help the property buyers of the state? Let's find out. Hello, I'm Naima Khatun and welcome to Property Matters. The Telangana government has recently enforced a new revenue act called the Telangana Rights in Land and Patadhar Passbook Act 2020. The aim of this new law is to bring reforms in land revenue administration and publish digitized land maps on Dharni portal. Dharni is a one-step portal for all matters related to land records, land details, ownership, mutation and registration. The digitization of the process is expected to reduce land grabbing and land disputes in the city. Dharani is uh, the e-governance portal introduced by the Telangana Government uh, Revenue Department and also this provides a one-stop portal for uh, both land records and also for registration services. So we can say that it's um, you know uh, an effort to uh, combine both revenue and registration services and uh, make it more easy and uh, you know convenient for the citizens to access their ownership records and also to avail the registration facilities. Telangana citizens can now avail benefits and services for revenue and registration purposes at the comfort of their home. There are many ways in which the Dharni portal helps. It uh, really uh, you know, uh, removes any intermediaries uh, role and um, it facilitates uh, a direct approach where it has really uh, cut down uh, the time and efforts that uh, were earlier required when a person registers a document and thereafter proceeds to get it mutated. So here, um, you know, as we understand, as the officials say, that uh, the time has been reduced almost for an only, only to an hour. So the moment the registration happens, immediately the mutation would happen. Harani has, has cut down uh, all those uh, unnecessary uh, time lapses and um, it is only uh, you know one hour um, that it would take from for a person to register and immediately to get it mutated. Real-time updation of uh, textual records would happen. The maintenance of uh, land records has become uh, easier now uh, for the officials as well as for the citizens to view their ownership and to guard their property. As of now, only the details of agricultural section can be checked on Dharni portal. The government is also working towards integrating the non-agricultural section and will allow its registration soon. Landowners and buyers can benefit from two sets of services provided in Dharni portal. So when we say the revenue services, revenue services, uh, uh, citizens can avail a mutation of their uh, you know, land records. They can search their land uh, details and uh, they can get the market value. It also facilitates uh, the uh, viewing of prohibited properties. One would be able to uh, you know, uh, un uh, know uh, or calculate the stamp duty, the registration fee, make the payment, get the receipt and then uh, you know, submit it, book a slot for registration and in case um, the person is unable to attend on the date of registration, they can reschedule the registration date. Can land records obtained on the Honey portal be used to initiate registration process in the portal itself? Do consumers have to pay any charges? Certified copies. These copies can be used for whatever uh, you know purpose that the purpose the person intended to use them. However, it also depends on, on the exactness of the purpose. Uh, suppose um, a certified copy is required uh, of a link document for the purpose of registration. Yes, it can be used. So definitely, yes, whatever the certified copies that are obtained through Dharani can be used for legal purposes. So uh, no, uh, you know, it does not really, uh, there is no cost that is paid to avail the services as such. Uh, but for, uh, you know, slot booking, uh, it seems there is a fee of 200 rupees that has to be made. Otherwise, there are no other costs that need to be paid um, unless, uh, you know, there is any statutory fee that is required to be paid. All you need to access the information is internet connectivity and a device to log in. As on today, the portal has received more than 1 crore 15 lakh hits since its launch and has been extensively used by Telangana land owners. I hope you like this video. For any query or suggestion, do write to us in the comment section below. This is Naima Khatun signing off with cameraman Manish Sharma and Gopal Krishna. Subscribe to MBTV and click on the bell icon.